Android users, I know you're getting a little bit curious about what iOS might feel like now that the new iPhone 12 has four cameras on board. Well, if you're ready to take the dive, I'm going to help you out with the biggest fear of changing from Android to iPhone, transferring your life between one platform to another. I'm gonna show you how to do this in under five minutes, so stay with me. Hi there, it's Charmaine, and welcome back to the channel that teaches you how to use your mobile phone without all of that unnecessary <coughs> tech garble that we don't really need to understand. No. I'm gonna teach you today a little trick that I know a lot of our customers really fear, and that's moving between Android and iOS. Before we do, hit that subscribe button for me because over the course of the next few months, you and I are gonna go on a journey to learn to use your mobile phone. So today in the demo, we're going to be transferring contacts, photos, videos, free apps, and all of your mail accounts between your old Android device and your new iOS device. Let's dive in. Now in this demo, I'm going to show you how to transfer your contacts, your mail accounts, your free apps and your photos and videos. So the first step in this process is to wipe the iPhone back to start mode. So you're going to need to back up any data that you have on here to your iCloud account or to your laptop, whichever you prefer. For some of you, you might be starting with the iPhone fresh from the box, so this first step isn't necessary. In order to wipe your iPhone, let's go into settings. Let's go through to general and scroll down to reset. Here you can see erase all content and settings and that's the one we need, erase now. You enter in your pin code, let's enter in the Apple ID as well and we're ready to go. And you can see my iPhone is now completely erased back to the start. If you've received your iPhone brand new and you've just taken it out of the box, this is also what you're going to see it set up. So now we're going to start the iPhone setup process. Now we're at the Wi-Fi network selection option. It's really important that you set your Android and your new iPhone up on exactly the same network. So now in the setup process, you eventually get to the apps and data screen, and that's the all important point where we need to get to. We need to select here, move data from Android. And then we're gonna take our Android phone. On the Android phone, we wanna go to the Google Play Store, and we're going to download an app, which is called Move to iOS. Install this app. And we're gonna say, allow move to iOS to access your contacts and the photos, media, files, and SMS. Back to the iOS phone, we need to click continue. Here's my code, and I'm gonna enter this into my Android. And as you can see, the transfer process is beginning and I've ticked Google account, messages and camera roll for the transfer. Click next. And there you see the transfer has completed. Let's go back to our iPhone setup. So here we go, my iPhone is now set up and it's asking me if I want to add the free apps. So let's add all the apps that we've transferred over also. Here are my photos transferred from my Android. Those are my contacts. And here is my mail account. I just need to enter in my passcode to make that work properly. 
Check out our latest video on iOS 14 and some of the incredible new features of the latest download from Apple. Now I'm always curious to find apps to help businesses run better, so if there's a particular function that you'd like to see in your phone, ask me the question in the comments below and we'll see if we can find an app specifically for that issue. See you next time. Oh.